The cool thing about Midsummer is a lot of Shakespeare's comedies, as time has progressed, um, the wit becomes harder to comprehend for a modern audience because it's referencing things that, you know, we don't all read Ovid in high school now. Um, and we don't get the French crown syphilis jokes. Um, but th those were things that Shakespeare's audience would have gotten and would have enjoyed. Midsummer, of all of the comedies in my opinion, retains its comic value the most because it's a pastoral. Um, it's lovers running off into the woods and being changed by their experiences and falling over things and fighting with each other. And I mean, that's, that's reality TV. We get that. And I think the reason Midsummer speaks to PLU and a PLU audience is the primary fight in the show is between the forces of reason and logic and the forces of passion. Um, and I think that that's a struggle that we in college always have to fight with. I'd say the biggest challenge has been when you focus on collaboration, that's really scary because it's a trust. And we're all trusting that the people around us are going to put in the time and step up. Um, so there's a lot that still needs to be done. Um, but we're in a good place, um, assuming we continue to trust each other and assuming we continue to all move forward together. Um, but it's not like my vision is being played out on stage, it's our vision. My interpretation with this show was taking um, the vision of a forest through a child's eyes. So I took with that what I would. And so it's gonna be very colorful and very, um, I would say whimsy almost is the word I would use. I feel like a mom, like my very first scenic design ever. I'm, you know, I've designed in class, but not for an actual production. So it's as it's coming together, I'm like a little bit teary eyed, like it's growing up, it's becoming real. I never thought it would be this far into it. And I'm just ready to see it put together and see what that looks like. Cause I'm really, I'm jittery, I'm nervous. What's fun about Shakespeare is that you can take it in a lot of different ways. You can play up, different time periods or whatever, what, what have you. Um, contemporary is kind of a difficult design to do because we live in contemporary, so we don't really think about, you know, what do we wear? <laughs> it's a lot easier with an older time period because there's like a certain style. It's actually a lot of research. Um, start out with the script, read through the script, kind of get an, an idea or a feel for the characters and what their personalities are like. Um, and then the next step would be like talking to the director, see what his, in, like he's envisioning for the play. Um, so that gives you like the framing of like what time period are we in? Um, how does that play out in like the characters? What kind of society are they in? That sort of thing, the place, the time. This has been an incredible process and uh, this is a really cool show. This is just a really cool show, and the more time I spend with the script, the more time I see the power in the words, the power in Shakespeare. Oh, it's showtime. Oh, it's showtime. Far too soon. <laughs>